поставленной перед выбором либо править порочной и слабеющей империей, либо сделать вызов судьбе в надежде на другой шанс, лучший шанс, чем в этой жизни. Что должен был выбрать король? Если у человека истинный выбор, можно только шаг за шагом сравнивать происки судьбы и таким образом осознать всю ее жестокость. И тогда я вернулся в прибежище своего врага, в крепость братства Сарафенов, в которую считается невозможно проникнуть ни единому смертному. Невозможно для смертного. Глубоко в этих стенах моя жертва ждала. Мобиус, похититель времени, предатель и вечный игрок, использующий живых существ в качестве своих пешек. Найти всякого, кто проникнет сюда. Но мы уже прочесали всю территорию. Мы уничтожили всякую живую душу, которая осмелилась переступить порог. Господин будет доволен. Пришла пора для Мобиуса ответить на пару вопросов. Ради его же блага я надеялся найти его в приветливом настроении. Necessary to feed, and the unusual event of a feast prepared by the Seraphan must be savored.
What was that? <laughs> the touch of water is like acid to a vampire. I had to find another way to pass. This passage undoubtedly led to the time streamer. My prey was nearly in my grasp. But the door had been sealed by a blessed barrier. As I approached, the reaver resonated in response. Perhaps its dark sorcery could dispel these holy barriers.
Locked. What a love of doors these pathetic humans have. This emblem was unmistakably of vampire origin and designed to enhance the Reaver's power. But this coincidence seemed too convenient. Mobius clearly meant for me to find it. Sound the alarm! Vampire! Don't let him escape! Surround him! Surrender, fiend, and we will promise you an easy death. I could promise you the same, but it would be a lie. Balance emblem. resonating effect on the Reaver.
This door had been equipped with a singular lock, requiring an unusual key. Somehow, I would find it.
You needn't linger in the shadows, Cain. It has been a long time, hasn't it? No banter, Mobius. You know why I'm here. Yes, Raziel. You sought to introduce your own pawn into this game, and now he's been swept from the board. By your hand, I suspect. Where is he? Perhaps you should ask, when? <laughs> How humiliating it must be for you to come begging at my doorstep for answers. Enough wordplay. Don't threaten me. <sighs> you see, I have the upper hand. How remarkable that the great Cain should succumb to the scepter's power like any common vampire. <sighs> Still so arrogant after all these years, thinking you've devised some brilliant plan. You 
know nothing. You have read the signs, but missed their meaning. You believe you are that myth of vampire prophecy, the scion of balance, and that Raziel holds the key to fulfilling your destiny. <coughs> but your messianic delusions have blinded you to Raziel's true nature. You have no idea what you've unleashed. There was a time when you might have heeded wise counsel when it was offered. Now, your vanity has made you witless. You will have to learn the truth for yourself. You'll be needing this. Your strength will return after I have departed. But by then, you will have more urgent concerns than pursuing me. Perhaps, when we next meet, you will have learned a little humility. These strange creatures seem to manifest from the very shadows. Mobius' attempt at stopping me was not one of his better efforts. When I found him, it would be my turn to offer a few surprises. Surrender, Raziel. Abandon this petty rebellion. It was I who made you. Your life had played out, and in my grace, I spared you. You are my reaper of souls. You have no other purpose, no higher destiny. Just this. Accept your calling, Raziel. Let go of these vain hopes. Relinquish your will, and feed. No. What do you profit from this defiance? There's some grim satisfaction in infuriating you. My patience is eternal, Raziel. How many eons can you bear to languish here? The wheel of fate must turn. All are redeemed in the cleansing agony of birth, death, and rebirth. This is the engine of life, the purifying rhythm of the universe, to which all souls are irresistibly drawn. Yours is a necessary and noble function, Raziel. Enough of your sermonizing. Are you trying to bore me into submission? Why must this game go on? We both know what you are. You are no better than the vampires you so despise. A voracious parasite, cloaking its appetite in a shroud of righteousness. I refuse to do your will. I can see into your heart, Raziel. It is not your will, but cowardice that keeps you here. How so? You know what fate awaits you when you leave the underworld. That phantom weapon you bear is a constant reminder, isn't it? The sword is waiting for you out there somewhere, and you tarry so as not to meet. Oh, <laughs> 
Below me swirled an ominous looking mist. I knew that if I fell, it would mean my peril. is so easily proved. Your way is sealed until you have offered further evidence of your obedience. I must feed you before I depart this place. You must feed yourself, Raziel. The wheel must turn. Ah, now you understand. go, but remember, you are mine. You can no more escape from me than you can escape yourself. This room cleared of its vermin. If you wish to leave it.
Where do you think you're going, little soul? You can't escape. escape had not been anticipated, or my benevolent master would not have expended such efforts to prevent me from going. And if my departure displeased him, then that was a victory, however small, for me. In the spectral realm, water is as thin as air, putting this opening far beyond my reach. But once I found my way into the physical world, I might be able to swim up there. This door would only open when fitted with an appropriate artifact. But to use such an object, I would first have to find a way back into the material realm.
At last, I discovered a conduit into the material realm. I would finally escape the spirit world and take one step farther from my tormentor. <laughs> Did you think to receive the same favors after your rebellion as before? No, Raziel. I have no need for you to enter the physical world, so no conduit will be granted. You serve me adequately as a wraith, and a wraith you will remain. As I emerged, I was granted a vision of what I would become if I did not escape the Spectral Realm. For these two were agents of my master, hunting the lost souls that struggled to escape the endless twilight of the Underworld. My master's plan for me was ominously clear. Like these mindless hunters, I existed only to fuel him with souls, siphoning their energy to feed him and his wheel of fate. This artifact seemed as though it was made for that unusual lock. Now the door could be opened.
Malik, the great Seraphim warrior. I had met him before. His sword and shield seemed to have gone astray. Find your master. <laughs> Quickly, Mobius is in the tower. 
good. Malek's missing shield. I hated to restore his dignity, but I would need to return this to his monument before I could progress. <laughs> 